Welcome. Please pause video to view written information. Video is shot on a two-post lift for clarity. Right side installation is shown. The process is the same for both sides. Uninstall bump stop by removing two bolts with a 15 mm or in some cases a 16 mm wrench or socket. A floor jack from under the receiver can create space between the frame and axle if needed. The kit arrives pre-assembled. Remove frame mount bolts and cradle nuts from each assembly. They are marked left for driver side and right for passenger side. Install top plate to frame with two hardware provided. Install assembly to top plate with four 3 8 by 1 inch carriage bolts and torque to approximately 25 foot pounds. Install upper axle cradle and lower truck until it makes contact. Install lower axle cradle and install the nuts. When tightening, ensure cradles are in line and an equal amount of threads show between the two bolts. Torque to approximately 25 foot pounds. Torque air spring bolt to approximately 25 foot pound. Route airline through frame and out the back side. Connect airline to the air spring compression fitting. Airlines are pre cut about 4 and 8 foot. 4 foot line is for the left side, and the 8 foot is for the right and meant to cross over to meet the left. Lines have a black protective cap installed to aid routing and keep the line clean. Remove after installation. Secure the right, left, and air fill line to compression key fitting. Secure along the chosen path with zip ties. The air fill line can be placed inside the box, license plate, or anywhere you prefer by drilling a 5 6 hole. Please ensure lines are secured away from exhaust, suspension, and spare tire operation. Fill system to 100 PSI and leak check connections with soapy water and double check all fasteners for securement. 